All right, I'm going to do another really quick one. This is for Brad as well. It's about importing 3D model data, STL files, STP, I think they are. So he's working on this banner thing, so I quickly drew this up. So we're just going to come up here to go File, Import, Component 3D Model. Here's the SKP file that he sent me. So open that up. And then we have some options here. The size really doesn't matter as much as it is uh, getting some thickness to it. So I've got everything locked in the XY ratio. Let's just give this 0.5. Everything is rudimentary. Center model, put it in the middle. Uh, I'm going to unlock and I'm going to take these down. So that's 13. Let's go 10. Yeah, that might be a little too skinny. Yeah, that's... Okay, we can, we can live with that. Now I'm going to position and import. So this here is actually very important. It shows you how much of the model you're actually going to get. You go all the way down there and import it. We have no model, but it is here. And if you screw up like this, you can just come up here to the components, right click, re-import. You can see how the ribbon is moving here. So let's see what this gives us. Import. There it is. Right there across the top. Now it's really big. It overlaps everything. So if we go back over here to component, click on this. So we're... We've got this component selected. We can click on here, make it smaller, grab this, put it where we want in our design. We can even play with some of the shapes and some heights and stuff, but there you go. And then you can actually come in here and draw your curve and put your text on top of it. I hope it helps.